All right. It's been a second and I apologize, but things got a little busy. So today is going to be an update video because I don't want to just jump back into a video without explaining what is going on and what's happening, where I've been, all of that. So hello, hi, it's nice seeing you guys again. Basically I had, and this is such an obvious excuse, I had a lot of school stuff come up, being in college, junior year, there's just a lot of things going on. I was working on this huge case study for a scholarship that I am trying to get. It was something I should have started a long time ago and unfortunately I didn't. So that consumed a solid three weekends and yeah, that's usually when I like film and do stuff. So that was off the table, like filming was off the table at that point. Also, I just had my birthday not that long ago. I turned 21 on October 29th. And before that, after that, I've just been hanging out with people, trying to enjoy college life and whatnot. Um, yeah, love YouTube, but of course I want to like live my life as well. And I'm sure most of you understand, so that's really, really awesome. Basically, the next video that I wanted to post was my capsule wardrobe. However, I have been thinking about it and I want to do something a little bit different just because the weather's been kind of weird here. Basically, I think I'm just going to do a combined fall winter capsule because the next time you see a capsule wardrobe for me, it won't be until I am in Copenhagen. And I kind of just want to title that like a study abroad capsule. So I kind of just want to finish out the year on something a little bit more solid, I guess, because my fall one has been so wishy-washy. Um, right now there's still some summer stuff hanging here that I need to get rid of it's just kind of a mess right now so I'm going home this weekend I'm finalizing items and I'm like switching out and hopefully next weekend you will see my fall winter capsule I'll probably bump it up to like 40 items just to have a little bit more leeway but it should be fairly easy because most of the fall stuff I have it's like an outerwear piece in the fall time would count as sort of like just something I would wear inside in the winter too so everything really kind of flows so Hopefully it should all work out. Otherwise, I am hoping to do um, something kind of like a veg vlog kind of soon, maybe with another person. We'll see. Hopefully you guys would be interested in that. Otherwise, yeah, not sure what else is on the agenda right now, but hopefully I can get back into being a little bit more regular with posting. Um, things are a little less hectic now, so we should be good to go. <laughs> and yeah, basically that was it. Um, I figured I would leave you guys with some music favorites real quick, just to catch you guys up on what I have been listening to. And I will link a playlist down below. It's a real short, sweet, cute one of just everything I have been enjoying. And I will also leave the names of the songs and artists for those of you who do not have Spotify, but I wanna make it convenient for those of you who do. Recently, I saw St. Lucia again, really, really good live. I love them, they have a lot of energy, but someone that opened for them is a group called Maids. They are actually from Des Moines, Iowa, so Des Moines represent. And I saw them open there as well as here up at Iowa State. They performed for a little free music event as well and really, really, cool, vibey, dancey stuff. Particularly the song Takes a Little Magic. That's probably like their most like banger of a song, if you will. The song I Still Wonder by the Chain Gang of 1974, a somewhat new release. If you like the 1975 kind of, it's that cool sort of, I don't know, it's got a nice little groovy sort of danceable beat to it as well. That's what I've been into as of late. That's what I'm kind of always into. The song Lost Youth, Lost You by How To Dress Well. Really cool sort of mm, kind of experimental pop slash R&B inspired musician. Real loose interpretation of those genres though. Just a really cool guy basically. You should check him out. He has a completely new album that came out not that long ago. Um, the song Body Language by Carly Rae Jepsen. Her B-side was great. If you liked Emotion, you will like her B-side. You've probably already listened to it at this point, but it's just something else I wanted to throw in there. There's a couple other tracks that'll be listed down below and all this playlist as well. But yeah, those are basically the highlights. So thank you all so much for being patient. More videos to come soon, I promise. I know I was gone for like a month and it was crazy. And especially the last video I posted left you guys on a really like sour note. I've been fine. I just, I've been so fine that I just haven't been posting at all so yeah it works out that way sometimes anyway thank you all very very much for watching and subscribing and being cool people and i will see you all in the next one bye